Anthony Bennett made history in the 2013 NBA draft by being the first ever Canadian picked at the top spot, and the crop of Canadians in the 2014 draft class are expected to leave a rather large footprint of their own. The likes of Andrew Wiggins, Nick Stauskas, and Tyler Ennis all possess raw ability, talent, and the desire to be the best. But the real question is, where did all this start? I think it's I think it's a continuation of the process that's begun maybe generations ago and we're just now seeing the fruit of that. Uh, you know what what team in the NBA had more fans outside of their arena uh, during the playoffs watching on a big screen the playoffs when it was being held in another market like Toronto did. Uh, you look at towns like London in our league that's drawing 8,000 people when we go down to watch them play. Canada's bursting, and it's not a surprise at all to me that these guys are getting this good. And the next crop that's coming up is just as good, if not better. Players like Tristan Thompson, Andrew Nicholson, and Corey Joseph are slowly making a mark of their own. So, what does this do for the next generation of Canadian ball players? Inspiration. Inspiration. Um, one thing that I always say is inspiration is a spark is a spark plug to success. It just motivates the sixth, seventh, eighth graders to work, you know. And, and I, as an evaluator of talent, I'm I'm, I'm cr uh, traveling across the country. I'm seeing kids like seventh and eighth graders. They have a left hand. They have a right hand. Of have a high IQ. They have explosiveness, like stuff that you didn't see years ago. It's it's going to just keep continuing for a long time to come. And I think you're going to see Canada be the second biggest basketball market in the world in in, in the years to come. It's we're just scratching the surface. You know, people are looking to Canada and saying, hey, we got talent. We're truly scratching the surface. It's, it's scary what Canada's going to look like in a couple years from now. Fast Break is brought to you by the National Basketball League of Canada. It's the odd man in.